Hello everybody and welcome to my channel, Love, Truth, and Wisdom Tarot Guidance. I am here today bringing you another pick a card reading and today's topic is going to be what do they love about you? So we're going to look at what do, basically, what do they love about you? Pretty self-explanatory. So we have here four piles here, the black heart, the butterfly, the kissy face emoji, and the heart eye emoji. You can feel free to pick more than one if you feel guided to do so. Um, I am doing personal readings, so I will leave that information down below if you feel guided to get a personal reading from me. I want to say thank you to all my new subscribers and all the likes, shares, and comments I'm getting. I am truly happy and I love all you guys and appreciate you guys for helping me grow my channel. I love doing this and I hope you enjoy these videos as much as I enjoy doing them. So without further ado, let's get to your reading. Okay, group one, the black heart emoji. This is your reading for what do they love about you. So the first thing I'm getting is what they love about you overall is they love that you're always changing. They love that you're always growing. They love that you're always evolving and transforming. This could be physically, like within your looks, you could change your hair a lot or change your clothes a lot or just always be changing the way you look a lot. But I do feel like this is more of a spiritual thing. Like I feel like you always are growing, evolving, maturing. Um, just trying to like be more enlightened be a better human being just like you're very into soul growth you could be very into like spirituality um they also love that you're very confident in yourself so you're always i feel like you change your clothes a lot so you're also very confident in your body i feel like you do love your body you love being naked i feel like you're curvy and you have a nice like bum they love your bum so i feel like they're very into your hips and your bum area i feel like you're very um um with the word like you express yourself through clothes so i feel like you're just very expressive through your physical like aspects of yourself like your hair your clothes your shoes your makeup stuff like that but like i said i do feel like you're always transforming and changing and growing i feel like they love when something you know bad happens to you or challenging happens to you you always kind of grow through it and become and come out of it like a better person almost like a lotus flower i'm getting i feel like you have a lot of strength and they love that you have a lot of strength and that you're very victorious and you have a lot of willpower you're very confident and you're always moving forward you don't really laminate in the past i feel like you're very um regenerative so if something happens to you you heal really quickly that could be something that they love about you you just you move forward quickly but you don't kind of like ignore what's happened to you you kind of just go through it so you can get through it and grow through it and make sure you're always like looking to be like a better person i feel and they really do love that about you um with the be willing to express love here i feel like they love that you're very loving you're always expressing love and compassion and kindness to others to animals to plants to other people you're very like open when it comes to like emotional stuff you're not really like emotionally like repressed or like you know you don't kind of suppress your emotions you don't get overwhelmed by emotions you're very comfortable with your feelings because you know your feelings are the compass to where you need to go and where you need to be and where you don't need to be you're very very comfortable with feelings and i feel like they love that about you because they could be kind of like um not like they're like they're just maybe not as comfortable as feelings as you are with your feelings but they love that you express love and because you know to express love you have to receive love so you're very like reciprocal i feel i feel like you're very giving you're very um balanced when it comes to you give appropriately and you receive appropriately you're very into balance i feel like they love that you're so balanced and so loving i feel like they also love that you are very nurturing i feel like maybe you could plant or you like create crystals or shells or something kind of different that maybe they've never been with a person or they've never really liked or like seen a person like you before whatever it is you're very unique to them you're very magical to them you're just you're such like if you're a feminine watching this like you're such a feminine energy and even if you're not like you're very in tune with your feminine energy if you're masculine like watching this like whatever it is you're just very into yourself like and not like self-absorbed but you're very aware of yourself you're very aware of your feelings you're very aware of your emotions you're very aware of how you feel and why you feel and what that means to you and not in like an annoying like you're always crying type of way but in a way where it's like empowering and you know what you want and you know why you want it and you don't like hesitate or kind of wobble in terms of like what you want and 
where you can get it and why you can't get it type of thing if that makes sense but um you're always willing to express love you're always willing to like give help to others and to whatever type whatever love means to you whether it be like hugs kisses comfort time effort like you're always willing to give and help others and i feel like they really love that about you um i do feel like they love that you don't get scared a lot you're very confident in yourself and i feel like other people see you as very confident i feel like other people admire you and they love that about you as well because they also admire you i feel like you can make this person a little bit nervous sometimes on coming towards you um i feel like this person gets like nervous or anxious when they know they're gonna see you or they know they're going to spend time with you but then once they spend time with you it's like you guys are on the same page you guys are like pretty much equals like there's no like person in a, on a pedestal or anything like that i feel like they just get so caught up with how great you are and how like um fantastic and like adventurous and confident and 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 just kind of how willful you are that they kind of get into their own insecurities a little bit not a lot but you both are kind of on the same page when it comes to that because i feel like they are confident and they are very willful too maybe just in different ways but they love that they just love that about, about you um they love your hair i feel like your hair could be curly and on the darker side or like i said you could change your hair a lot like you could be a redhead or a brunette or something like that but they love like the texture and the waves of your hair um they love that you're open-minded and that you can you're willing to try new things i feel like um you're very like adventurous like you could like to try like um you could be like an adrenaline junkie and like to just kind of roller coasters or, like amusement parks or like like um zip lining or bungee dive like you're just very adventurous and you like to try new things because you're so confident in yourself i feel like they also love that you're very stable within yourself very secure within yourself you're always planting new seeds you're always um 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 just trying to grow and nurture and plant seeds everywhere because you want to experience life in whatever way shape or form that life happens to you you're very much into a life oriented place where you know that shit happens good shit and bad shit happens but it's how you handle it it's how you react to it that makes you who you are um character is built through adversity so you're kind of like that type of person or and they love that about you they love that you can just take life by the horns and do what you have to do while having fun and being loving and being expressing and then taking the bullshit and the crap with it but also growing through it and becoming like a completely new and better person out of it and just really evolving to the best version of yourself i feel like um they love that you are very like i said adventurous and you're always changing because you have change here number five so i feel like you're very um you challenge them a lot to be honest i feel like you challenge their ideas and not in like a negative sense where you're always like kind of debating or combating them i feel like in like a kind of like a cute competition way like you're always challenging challenging them to try new things and challenging them to be a um the best version of themselves and challenging them to do different stuff to like express and live life the way that you feel you need you want to express it i feel like you get this person out of their shell i feel like this person could be really rigid and stuff like that and they love that about you they may not express it but they do love that about you because they get to experience new things and then when they're with you i feel like there's just you guys are very intimate so i feel like you have a lot of intimate moments with this person and they love that about you um i feel like you love candles i feel like you're very into spirituality so i feel like you love candles and you love your bed you love to be comforted you like to be comfy and you love luxurious things and they also love that about you because they want to provide you with those things um but you're not like where it's like you know high maintenance or anything because as much as you love being indoors and in bed and in luxury you also love being outside you can kind of camp out and be cool you can be in the park and lay on the grass and be cool you could be in like your mansion and be cool like you're just a cool person to them and i feel like they really really love that about you and they really do see a future with you and they just they love that you're such like a cool i just i'm hearing like you're such a cool person like they've never experienced someone like you and they're very very lucky to know you and get to like experience life with you you've kind of changed this person's life for the better and you've shown them how to grow during hard times how to evolve how to be the best version of themselves how to express love how to be open-minded how to always be flexible and it's okay to change but always be secure in who you are but you know don't take life too seriously but you know you take you know it's, it's a healthy balance like i said i feel like you're very balanced in 
what you take seriously and what you don't take seriously. You're serious about what you want, but you're not serious about how you get it or when you get it or, you know, stuff like that. And I feel like you've really taught them that and they love that about you. They love that you teach them how to be, I feel like I want to say like how to be a human being because I feel like you're a very spiritual being. You could be like a light seed or a start, a light seed, well, a light worker or a star seed and like um i feel like they're just in awe of you like you're just so different from anyone they've ever dated or been with and you are just teaching them so much so continue on you know being who you are and doing what you're doing they love everything about you i honestly don't feel like they there's nothing about you that they don't like because you're always growing and you're always teaching them how to grow and change with the times and change with the circumstances and that it's okay to change and it's okay to be flexible but always be kind of you know firm on what your what you want in terms of like your future but you can be flexible on how you get it so um this person just really really loves that about you which is really really cool and really really sweet and yeah it's just really really positive so yeah um that's all I see so I'm gonna leave it here um feel free to check out one of my other piles if you want more information um thank you for watching love and light to you and I will talk to you guys later take care okay so if you chose the butterfly pile the second pile this is your reading for what do they love about you so your first card here change in the wind what they love about you is that you're always changing with the wind and not in a bad way you kind of just kind of go with the wind you go with the changes that happen to you in your life and you know it's a time to kind of reinvent yourself or or grow or evolve or be the best version of yourself you, you see you see the beauty in changes and the beauty in chaos the beauty of things happening the way they're supposed to happen even if they don't seem really comfortable or they seem kind of chaotic or whatever the case may be they really really love that about you they love that you kind of go with the flow you go where the wind blows i feel like you could be a free spirit and really just kind of you know wherever the wind blows that's where you go whatever your heart tells you to do that's what you do you really are a person who follows your heart i feel like they love that you are very patient with them and you're just patient you just have a patient nature um i feel like you're very nurturing and they love that you put an effort into this relationship and i feel like um, they really appreciate that for some reason. I feel like they love that you're very loyal and committed to them, even if you're not in a commitment with them. Um, if not, they want to be and you want to be, but even if you don't have like that title or whatever, they very much love that you're committed to them and they know that they can trust you and they know that they're gonna like commit to you in some type of way in, in marriage or whatever because you do have the wedding card here but they they just love that you're so relaxed you are very much free-spirited to go with the flow i feel like you could have super long hair that they really love and they love that you just lounge and you really do follow your heart you really do follow the beat of your own drum you don't really allow people to tell you what to do you listen to your own intuition i feel like you're very abundant and you know how to work the laws of abundance the laws of the universe you very much in um know what to invest in know when to harvest know when it's time to invest know when it's time to plant the seeds and water and stuff and then you know when to kind of harvest what you've made um and they really find that quite remarkable so they really love here miracles and blessings everything has a gift so they really really do think that you are a miracle and a blessing in their life um they really do think that you are a gift to them they love that you are very maybe gifted in terms of following your heart they think you're very lucky and they think that you're very you bring them luck you bring them good luck you bring them great harvest um they love that i'm getting you really just flow like you're very in into water nature like you could be an air sign so you could be like a libra or like a gemini and aquarius i'm getting more libra energy but um you could be one of those signs but you're you're just very beautiful um you could have a really small nose but they love the way you do your makeup it's very like it's very natural but it, it you you know that like they know you're wearing makeup type of thing but you do it in a very natural type of way 
I feel like um, they love that you could have your head in the clouds a lot and be a very big dreamer and they love that about you because your dreams actually come true like like when you dream or when you manifest something it actually happens and they're like in awe of that and they love that about you like you're just so magical to them and you're just so like in tune with nature in tune with the world in tune with the universe you're very like in tune spiritual like go with the flow type of person and they really really love that because you're like that but you're also very committed and you're very loyal and you're very stable and you're very secure with them like you feel very secure and they like that you feel secure you could like be playing house with this person and living with this person and they love that they love that you live with them um if you don't live with them they want you to live with them i feel like you can also deal with challenges in a very understanding manner i feel like you heal you know how to heal yourself and you know how to heal others and they love that about you um you're very much in tune to your body and they are very much in tune to your body i feel like you really do love your body particularly your breasts um and your legs and your thighs they love your stomach and i feel like they love your face and your breasts and stuff like that um I feel like you're very into like moon cycles so for some of you you could be like you know when there's a new moon you manifest and when there's a full moon you release I feel like you're very in tune to the universe and to like the con the like the conscious universe and like and like you know your higher spirit and your higher power and stuff like that but you definitely they love that you deal with challenges in a calm and understanding manner they love that you communicate when something's bothering you like you're not one to kind of stifle your feelings or be passive or anything like that when something's wrong you tell them and they love that about you they maybe not love when it happens but they love that they can always trust you to communicate with them and be honest no matter how like hurtful or painful or you know uncomfortable the conversation is because you guys always come out of it better on the other side they love that you're super powerful they love that you're also into like unions and marriage and commitment and tradition because i feel like they are as well um they're very um passionate with you i feel like if you've discussed babies with them at some point or they want a baby with you i feel like they they love that you're very open when it comes to a union and like and you know losing your singlehood to come into a union with them they're very like they love that you're very like relationship oriented like relationship minded you're not very single minded like you like you definitely could be a libra i feel like but you're very like relationship oriented like you think about marriage you think about commitment you think about the long term and they love that about you um I feel like it scares them a little bit but like they don't mind because they trust you and like you're their person and they know that you're their person with manifestation here i feel like you um they love that like i said you manifest what you want if you dream something or set the intention for something it manifests like you're very like um positive minded you're very into law of attractions you're very into much the laws of the universe and they love that about you um definitely something about the moon and you like you like to tell yourself you imagine the best case scenarios and that honestly comes true for you so they're much definitely in awe when it comes to that kind of stuff like whatever you want to manifest you can manifest so they know that about you like i said they know and love that you're so magical and that you are very you're very much a mirror to them so you remind them how magical they are as well um in terms of like what they want and what they can do and what can they can accomplish like you're very much like in your power like in a very like you could be like a star seed or a light worker like you're very like light like work like very like just positive and very like affirmative and very comfortable and you know who you are and you know where you come from and you know where you're going type of person and they really do love that about you and and they just love how open you are and how like curious i'm getting like you're very curious you're very um um you're very like you like to shine a light on stuff you like to tell the truth about things you don't like you don't like secrets you don't like hiding things they love that about you um, you just, you like to have things out in the open. You like to have new beginnings. You're very, um, you're just very much in your power, I feel. And they really do love that. And you're just, you're, you're very like, yeah, you're just patient and kind and understanding. You're a miracle and a blessing to them. Like they love you so much and they just want you to know that. And they, and you just remind them of how much they love you every day just by being yourself. And, um, 
yeah that's really sweet i feel like that's all there is i feel like this person is like or the cards are just very much straight to the point in this type of energy whatever i'm feeling but that's what they love about you so i hope that was helpful if you want more information you can check out another pile love and light to you guys and thank you guys for watching and i will talk to you guys later take care okay my third pile so if you chose the kissy face emoji this is your reading for what they love about you so first thing i get here with this new life card um what they love about you is that you always have new ideas you're always giving birth to new ideas you're always grow growing and evolving um, you're always looking for new opportunities to grow and evolve um, they love that you're basically like a brush of a breath of fresh air like you're you're you give them new life you are they're always like every time they see you or talk to you you're always like a breath of fresh air you're always giving them new life new hope new ideas new things to think about I feel like you're always renewing yourself you're always trying to grow and evolve and just be a better person Person and just be kind of lighthearted and go with where life is taking you I feel like you're very much in law of attraction whatever you want you manifest into your life you're very much the magician and they love that about you they love that you're into like spirituality you're into moon magic or like something about tarot or something like that but you're very much you have a lot of powers and they love that you're very in tune to your powers and most of your powers comes from your emotions I feel I feel like you're very stable emotionally you you may not express a lot of emotion but you it's basically like still waters run deep within you like they love that about you that you may not express it but they know that you feel it and they feel that you feel it which is like really much like something they very much love about you um with the rest and relaxation rest and relaxation is essential i feel like they love that you're always resting or relaxing i feel like you sleep a lot and they love that about you they love that you're always taking it easy you're always going with the flow you're always taking naps or getting like beauty sleep they love that you like sleep and rest and just flow and chill out or not always on the go and not always like rushing or not always doing stuff like that i feel like they love that you always know when you need a break and when to take a break i feel like you listen to your own guidance when it comes to that and they really do love that about you i feel like maybe you tell this person a lot about your dreams that you have like you do have really fascinating dreams and they love when you express and tell them about your dreams because then they get to know you like so much better and they love that you reveal stuff about yourself because it deepens your bond together and they love that you just express yourself and without any type of like like um what's the word without really caring how it's gonna go you kind of just say what you have to say express yourself and then you go on with your day and they love that they love the fact that they're always getting to know you every time they speak to you and talk to you it's like they're getting to know a completely different person they're always learning things about you and they love that about you like they just feel like it's like being with a new person every day but it's it's really you you're just always keeping it fresh and always keep coming up with new ideas and new conversations and new topics and new stuff to do I feel like you're very determined determined with what you want and they love that when you want something you go after it I feel like you're really um witty and banter you keep things like funny you're very smart and like like I said like witty like you're very you're a good conversationalist to like conversate with um I feel like you're also very blunt and very kind of harsh like when it comes to communication so you may say things that to you just seem like you're saying it but it comes off a little blunt and harsh they may not say it but they actually like that because you're straightforward and to the point and they don't have to guess about what you're feeling or what you're thinking or what you're saying because you just say it so you're you're, you're a good communicator um you're very well balanced with the moderation card here i feel like um you you know good moderation you're not excessive or anything like you're you're just very balanced when it comes to your life your choices what you do what you don't do like it's nothing in excessive amounts or anything like that so that's really positive um i feel like you're they love that you're very joyful you're very excited your excitement can be felt even when you're not speaking or saying anything like your energy you just have a really positive joyous energy around you when they're with you I feel like you're always singing, you're 
basically always in a good mood because I feel like you just know a lot about what you want and you're just very happy like you know happiness is an inside job and it doesn't stem from anything outside of you you know that all is well in your world you know that your dreams are going to come true like I said they love that you're very sure about your dreams and what you want in terms of like that that's why like you're always taking a break or resting you're a very relaxed person like I feel like you're not uptight and you're very just going with the flow type energy and they love that about you as well I feel like um you're very sweet they love that you're sweet and vibrant and and um i'm getting like spring like you share their excitement you share their passions you see you share their joys and they love that about you as well you're very auspicious and you're very respectful and you're very um you respect the relationship you respect them um i feel like you're you're very much a good luck thing for them i feel like you really let your light shine you really are yourself especially when you're communicating you don't really care what other people think about the way you communicate you kind of just say what you have to say and they love that you're very fortunate i feel and they feel like they're very fortunate to have you like you're something about your very good luck to them i feel like they love um, that you're very optimistic and things fall into place with you by magic and it's because you have this magician card you're very in your own power you know how to work the law of attraction and they love that about you they love that you have a lot of potential and that you see a lot of potential in them in terms of like work and projects and ideas and um fortune is always smiling on you they feel like you're very fortunate and you're very lucky like i said and they just feel like your hopes and dreams are always filled and fulfilled and it's because you're very much in tune with how you feel and you're very much in tune with how the law of attraction works i feel like you're always like doing your own thing and not because it's like you're ignoring them or because you don't like them or love them or want to be with them i just feel like you're just always focused on making sure that you're happy and that you're in a good place so that when you do come to them that you don't like or you're not dependent on them being in a good mood for you to, for you to be in a good mood like you're in a good mood regardless and and they love that they love it actually makes them chase you and it makes you it makes them want you like more because it's like they don't feel that pressure to have to coddle you or be in a good mood or be happy because they just know like you're always going to be you you're always going to do your own thing you're always going to be in your own type of happiness and they are trying to like mimic that and like find their own happiness so that they can be they so they can feel like you're equal um you're just you're very well balanced and feel like um you they feel like they love that you are always learning things about yourself and you're always learning things about life which is why you guys have great conversations and very win witty conversations and very like it's like i feel like a lot of laughter and a lot of like sarcasm but like you can be very sarcastic and they love that about you but they know it's coming from a good place it's not coming from like a hurtful type of place um because they just love getting to know you they love that type of rep like um what's the, what's the word i'm trying to say they love that type of banter between you guys like they love the banter that you guys have um yeah um i feel like they love that you admit when you don't know something or when you're inexperienced at something which is why you're always conversating about things because you like to learn a lot of things you like to you have like i'm getting like you're just a very idealistic person and not in like a negative way like you just have a lot of ideas and you like to run them by people and you like to run them by your person and they love that about you because like i said they get to know you they love getting to know you on all levels they love when you reveal things about yourself like your dreams dreams your passions your goals your abundance your projects your work they just love getting to know you and they just love being around you and they they think they're very fortunate to have you and they love that you're very fortunate and you're very you're very much like like i said good luck like you're a good luck charm to them and they love that about you but you're also very balanced and you do nothing in excess you're very um into new beginnings and you're very stable within yourself and they love that like i said like you're very much into your own thing and they want to mimic that so that they don't become codependent on you always being happy like they you're teaching this person how to how to be their own happiness before they go out in a relationship or in a relationship where they feel like the other person should make them happy type of thing so that's what i see for you guys i hope that was helpful um you can check out one of my other piles if you want more information and if you feel guided to do so i'm sending you guys so much love and light thank you guys for watching and i will talk to you guys later take care
Okay, pile four, if you chose the heart eye emoji, this is what your person loves about you. So what they love about you with the imagine card here, it speaks of um, um, imagination, manifestation, creative thought, visualization, aligning your feelings, creativity. I feel like this person loves that you're really creative, you're really imaginative, your imagination leads for, to you manifesting what you truly want in your life and they love that about you. I feel like they love that you always align yourself with your feelings about what you want and you align yourself with the universe. You could be very much into spirituality and, and, and how the universe works and the law of attraction and all that fun stuff I feel like they love that you're always um, trying to decide like who do you want to be what do you want to be what do you believe in in order to have the life you want you're always imagining a better and new life for yourself and they love that I feel like you were really gifted with the power to imagine and manifest whatever you imagine so if you don't know that you are you know if you can dream it you can create it basically is what I'm saying and they see that and they know that and they love that about you um i feel like you're always daydreaming or visioning or you have a vision board or you're always meditating on your goals or just meditating in general and they love that about you you're very very creative so i feel like they love that you're creative and how you deliver your images through your creativity because it feeds your soul and they just see you're so passionate about whatever you're creating so you could be an artist of some kind you could like to draw or you know paint or I, for some reason I'm, I'm hearing you guys do hair or you guys do makeup or whatever the case may be but um whatever you imagine whatever your beliefs are they really love your beliefs and your beliefs about the world and about them and about yourself and about the like universe and stuff like that like you're just very into imagination at this time like i said they love that you daydream and that you're very connected to the universe i feel like they love that you're very romantic um i feel like they um love that you want this relationship to be real i feel like you they love that you make the effort when it comes to this relationship you're very much into physical touch so anything you like to like touch this person or like hand or or um, like I said, you like to touch this person and um, you like to th show your affection through touch, like a tender touch, and it means so much to them because they love that about you. They love that you're really affectionate in terms of your physical touch, like like I said, like hand-holding, kissing, hugging, grabbing, all that fun stuff. I feel like they love that you go after your dreams and, you know, even though you daydream and you manifest and you imagine a lot, you go after that because you have to make it real. And I feel like, especially when it comes to this relationship, Relationship. like I feel like you were the person that like not forced the relationship but you imagined this relationship and you knew where you wanted it to go and so you're making the effort to kind of make it what you want it to be and they love that because they know that you know what you want and they know that you're doing it for the best interest of both of you guys um together I feel like um I feel like you manifested this person definitely so I feel like they know that you manifested them and they love that about you that you knew what you wanted and that you didn't settle for anything less than what you wanted um I feel like this person loves that you're very prosperous and you have attributes that are very prosperous and very um like healthy and wealthy and you can imagine anything you desire into your reality i feel like you're very much like a go-getter and you make effort i do feel with the pride card that um your pride can get in the way a little bit where it's like you don't like to ask for help you like to do things by yourself and on your own um and maybe you like to kind of tell this person like how they what they should be doing or how they should be living their life and that's not like a great Thing, but it's like they don't mind it they love it because they know it's coming from a good place that you're very into your pride you're very into just make sure it's not like overly egotistical where it's like you're always right and they're always wrong I feel like you're just very like prideful in your work and what you do and you want everyone to be happy around you and you just think you know everything you know what's best for everyone and you probably know what's best for this person but it's coming from a good intention I don't feel like it's coming from an ill intent place or anything like that I feel like you're very abundant and you're very wealthy this person loves your hair so you could have really long hair really curly hair I feel like they love to smell your hair your hair smells really good to them so I don't know if you use like a scented shampoo or something like that 
um like i said you're very much affectionate you're always hug like touching this person with like either your foot or like rubbing their where your foot on their leg or like holding their hand when your guys are in conversation or hugging them or rubbing their back like you're just very like they love your touch they love when you touch them or anything like that um i feel like you could be very reserved sometimes and they love that because they like to they like the mystery of you so it just makes them want you more so sometimes you can come across really reserved and really kind of like and it's i feel like it's just because you're in your own world and you're daydreaming you're just minding your own business it's not even something you're doing kind of on purpose or anything like that i feel like you're very much into self-love and they love that you love yourself they love that you're into spiritual love to universal love to love conscious your love conscious person I feel like you have a lot of love to give and you really do love the world and you love the universe and you love your life. And it's not like a facade or it's not something that, you know, comes and goes. You try to keep at that vibration as much as you can because you just know better. I feel like you just know things and you're just like empowered and connected to that higher way of being, that higher way of vibrating when it's very much like a spiritual love. You're a very spiritual person. You're very into like spiritual love. I feel like you do have a spiritual connection with this person. I feel like you are very secure when making decisions about your future and they love that about you. You may share this with this person about future plans that you have and they love communicating with you they love sharing stuff with you and i feel like you share stuff you both share stuff but when you share stuff you don't take on what they're sharing as well wait whether it's like good or bad like you just you you're it's very like an interdependent relationship if you know what that means basically where it's like you share stuff they share stuff and you both don't really take on the other person's feelings or emotions or problems if you're sharing problems and stuff like that you kind of just let the other person be and let them have their problems and know that you support them either way but you don't take it on as your own type stuff so i feel like they love that about you that they can share anything with you and you'll just understand and show them love it's almost like a godly love they feel like you're very like a spiritual type of love and they they i feel like they don't express how much love they have for you but this person really has a lot of love for you like a lot of undying passionate almost like obsessive but not in like a negative way type of love for you and i feel like you for them but i feel like you keep it under wraps sometimes you make the effort by like expressing love through tender touch but you really do have a future planned out with them with this person and i feel like like they know that and they love that about you maybe you've expressed it like i said to them but maybe you've not expressed everything but like you know some of it and they love that you have future plans with them and that you're making future plans with them they just they love the idea of partnership and they love the idea of like a relationship and i feel like you do too i feel like for some reason i want to say like this is your perfect match like this is your match for your person like this is your person like and they and they think that you're their person and they just love you so much and they just you're always following your intuition and taking the steps that you're guided to take by spirit when spirit tells you to do something you do it and they love that about you um let me see here and they just they love the way you smell they love looking into your eyes they love your eyes you're very like pretty to them um they love your legs they just they love when you touch them so any type of touch you give to this person they love it so continue on that path but yeah i think that's all i see here for you guys in terms of what they love about you so i hope this was helpful and i hope you enjoy this reading um you can feel free to check out one of my other piles if you feel guided to do so i'm sending you guys so much love and light thank you for watching and i will talk to you guys later take care